it worked. This is so, so great. Oh my God. Like you don't understand like looking to take your music production skills to the next level. Well, in this video, I'm going to be sharing some crucial techniques that's going to help you with removing vocals or background music from any song. If you're new here, I'm 30 Killer Beats. Today we're going to be looking into Moises to help you with removing vocals from any song. Here is the website. When you go on the website, the link will be in the description, but they have a lot of options for you to use this service. Here's a simple user interface here. It's very easy to learn and uh, understand how to use. This is what I'll be using to remove vocals and background music from songs. And it is multi-platform, meaning that it's on the iPhone, the Android, iPad. So there should be no excuse not to use this. So let's go ahead and get started. So what we're going to do is to show you how this thing works. We're going to upload a song real quick. So you can easily click and drag some songs right here. But what I'm going to do is just go ahead and just drag, click and drag some of my favorite songs from Future. You know, just, just to say you wanted to get some of his vocals out and, you know, maybe use it for something else like your own production. Let's get started. So I'm going to choose this song right here, Jumping Out the Jet. I love this song. Such a great song. And let's just go ahead and remove the vocals. Maybe I want to do my own version to this song. So let's go ahead and click on next down here. As you can see here, you can select the type of separation you want. Do you want the, the pianos on a different track or do you just want the vocals in the instrumental? If I really just wanted the instrumental, I, I can just go to this one right here. But what I'm going to do just to show you how powerful this tool is, we're just going to go down here to five tracks and get everything. Go ahead and hit submit and let the magic happen. All right, so as you can see, this is my media here where all my songs that I can use to separate all the vocals from the actual instrumental or take out some of the sounds and separate that. So let's go ahead and go to jumping out the jet. All right, so here we go. We have the tool here, super easy to use. I love this for this reason. We have the vocals, the drums, the bass, the piano, and some other sounds separated. As you can see, there was really no piano in here and this, the machine algorithms and learning that this website does and this service does can basically tell that there's basically no piano in here. So you're not gonna have a track right there. So that's pretty good. So what I'm gonna do real quick because YouTube's uh, copyright system and all that. We're just going to play some of these sounds real quick and then go in and out and just show you how powerful this tool really is. And let's just jump out to the hook part. So say I wanted just to remove the vocals, I can easily press this mute button or just turn down the volume. Super easy, I was able to take out the vocals within minutes. Like like I said, if you're looking to remove vocals, definitely check out this website, link in the description. I did it within minutes and you know, all I had to do was just turn down this little track here and then boom, we have the vocals removed. Say like you just wanted, you really love the drums in this beat here. So let's just go ahead and remove everything else, even the vocals and just let's just hear it. Super easy, man. What, what if you're trying to learn how a song is made? You know what I'm saying? You're trying to figure out how did they make this song? You love this song so much. You can individually mute each track and then really figure out and listen to each sound to really enjoy that song or understand how it was made to get a better understanding of everything. And there are some other features in this website, not just removing songs and stuff like that. It comes with a very smart metronome maybe trying to figure out the right tempo or you just want to keep the metronome just so you know maybe the song doesn't start as soon as you play it so there's some metronomes in there to help you understand the tempo another really great thing that you can do uh, for your music production needs to help you get to that next level there are some really great pitch changing and key detect tools in this website here it automatically told me that this right here is a e minor and that's really great for me to know that this is the e minor song and what tuning it is and everything like that for you to know exactly what key it is maybe you're trying to you know play it on the piano um, or make a beat around it so you know you could also change the pitch we're just clicking some of these buttons here and you can really get that effect or that sound that you're really looking for which is really great for music production and you can also change the audio speed so for whatever reason you want a faster song or a slower song so the way how you would do that you would basically come to this metronome here and it says speed changer and you basically turn it up turn it down and what we're going to do is hear the sound as I play around. Real quick, what I'm going to do is turn it up and down so you can hear how it sounds.
as you can see that works really well and if you're trying to get that pacific speed you can really get that using this tool without even using anything else and the next feature that is also great in here you have all type of different options add like a three count before it plays maybe for some reason you just feel like the vocals or the drums and the instrumental is just a little bit too loud or you know some of the background sounds are a little bit too loud you can slowly just turn it down uh, maybe just one bass maybe for whatever reason you just want this whole song that you really really love and you don't want no vocals and you just want bass you know what i'm saying maybe you just want that for some reason you know you can easily get that by muting everything else around it and getting the bass and getting that sound that you're really looking for and another great thing is that you know you could also transcribe lyrics so i think that's pretty dope as well this would actually be shocking if it works because you know it is in beta right now and you know there are times that i want to add lyrics to songs that are on streaming service but i don't really have the time to either write it down and you know i didn't really you know write the song down word for word when i recorded the song so theoretically if i can use this to get all the lyrics and put it into streaming platforms you know that'll be great so i'm gonna give this time to load up and then come right back all right so here we go as you can see it worked this is so so great oh my god like you don't understand like all right so look so this thing i actually been waiting for for a very long time personally i've been waiting for something like this so i can use just to quickly get the lyrics and stuff like that without wasting time and writing it down now you don't have to worry about that anymore because you can just use this service here to get those lyrics so you can have those you know uh your favorite songs when they have those lyrics coming up at certain times and stuff like that when they're saying it you can easily do the same thing by just using this right here if you didn't write the song down which is super super useful and i feel like this is really great and relevant to the music community which is why i definitely wanted to do this video for you guys and uh showing you there are so many options like this one to help you with your music production needs make sure you guys check out moses website and their apps as well let me know in the comments what other videos do you want to see on this channel make Make sure you follow me on TikTok, Instagram. You guys stay safe. Peace.